Hi everyone, my name is Rosalind Streeter. Welcome to the Journey of Vision, where you will soon learn it's just so much easier with God. All right, you guys, come on, let's chat. Okay, guys, so jumping right back in. God said, I'm creating royalty, the great release. And who is he speaking to? Of course, it's you, children of God. And this is related to the wealth transfer, and we're already on part five. Now, I would encourage you to watch part five one through four during this series so you understand where God's heart is, what he's directing us to do, and also giving us a clear vision of what we will receive, okay? All right, so here we go, part five. God said, now son and daughter, this is not it. And he's talking about the directions and instructions he gave you in part four. Again, if you don't know what I'm speaking of, please watch part four. But he said, now son and daughter, this is not it. He said, remember, many of my children are suffering in a different way than you are. Mm, that's so good. And I can see people suffering and you feel like, man, it cannot get any worse. Like, how can this be? Like, what in the world is going on? But God is saying, you have, there's other children, right? Many, he said, many of my children who are suffering in a, even a different way, you know, worse than what you're going through. So God said, they will need you. Do not be selfish in any way. Now be mindful, be smart, be wise. Do not give it all away. Mm, that's so good. Now be mindful, be smart, be wise. Do not give it all away. So this portion of the great release that God is giving you, the greatest test, right? That's why God said, listen to me on who you're going to give this to. But he also said he wants you to be wise, be smart, be mindful, and don't give it all away. You know, as, as some people who are just extremely like, they just want to help everybody. Trust me, that was me. And God was like, no, <laughs> you're going to have to help yourself. Okay. So God said, be wise about it. Now, listen to this. This is so good, y'all. This is so good. He said, remember, there's going to be a time where all things will get still. And you will need to have finances to sustain you until I choose to release the next portion. So this great release, which is beautiful that he call it a great release, right? So I, only, I can only imagine what he's going to call the next release, but okay. <laughs> but he's saying this is the beginning of it. So he's going to release this part and he wants you to be smart with it and hold on to it. And only do what he directed you to. So maybe there's a part of it that you, again, that you will give related to the testing that he gives to you, the directions, the instructions, right? But also within that, he wants you to hold on to it because he said, he said, there's, remember, there's going to be a time where all things will get still and you will need to have finances to sustain you until I choose to release the next portion, okay? And then I could actually see the world, y'all, getting real still. I mean, real, real still. It was, it was even quiet almost. It was like real quiet. Um, I don't know how to explain it, but I can definitely understand what God is saying right here when he's saying you're going to need this to sustain you because nothing will move right nothing is going to happen during that time and so this is the preparation time of what he wants you to do with the portion that he released called the great release and then i love this part mm. when he's y'all i love god so much let me just tell you <laughs> but when he said until i choose mm. to release the next portion that just, if that doesn't grab my heart, and the reason why is because first off, when he said until, that told me right there, the sentence before that, when he said, remember, there's going to be a time where things will get still, 
and you will need to have finances to sustain you, period. Then he said, until, y'all, that tells me that it's only seasonal, right? It's only seasonal that we're going to go through such a time where things are still. Mm. But God said he's going to sustain us. He's going to sustain us. And on top of that, he said, until I, the great I am, choose. My God, until I choose to release the next portions, which tells me this is only God. And he's the only one in charge. And I'm okay with that. I have great peace with that, that he's in charge of what is next and the things to come and why things will get still. If he wasn't, I wouldn't be okay, right? My peace would leave me. But I have great peace understanding that God has us. Mm. And I pray that you guys caught that as well. So that is it for part five, you guys. Definitely, if you need to rewind that, that is it's so good. It's so good. I'm going <laughs> to read it over myself. <laughs> but part six, you guys, is coming right up. And of course, we love you. Bye.